What is up you guys, this is All Day and Day 1 on the PS4 and I'm going to be giving you another Apex Legends video. And for this video, I'll be giving you a guide on Bangalore. So before we start, I just want to mention that I am by no means a professional player, I'm just someone who enjoys playing the game and also someone who really enjoys figuring out some of the best ways to utilize certain characters. Obviously there will be more and other ways you can use each different character, not just the ways that I use them, but these are some of the ways that I found that was best for myself and I think would be very useful for you guys. So. Just to get started, we're going to go over her abilities such as her passive, tacticals, and her ultimate. So her passive allows her to have an increase in movement speed when being shot at, not necessarily being hit by the bullets or anything or taking any damage, but if a grenade is thrown at you in your direction or a bullet does fly near you or you're just in any real danger, then you'll get a burst of speed allowing you to zoom your way away from the danger or you can rush towards the danger rushing towards the enemies. Her tactical is one of the best tacticals in the game in my most honest opinion because it allows you to either flank the enemies or block their vision, creating a huge opportunistic window for you and your allies. What's great about the smoke gun is it also allows you to shoot it at a long range and you also get up to two charges. So you can shoot one of them at the enemies and then you can shoot one kind of like in between yourself and the enemies or you can shoot it kind of like at the enemies and then shoot it at you if you need to revive an ally. So now for her ultimate. Her ultimate is basically an artillery bomb. She would throw out a flare and then bombs would drop down. Now those bombs will not detonate right away, they'll either detonate after a short amount of time or if an enemy is running into it. Now I'm also not really sure if the bombs will detonate automatically if you shoot at it but I'm pretty sure they do if you do shoot at it. Also keep in mind that enemies will also have a missile symbol on their screen telling them that they're basically in the missile's radius. Some of the best ways to utilize her abilities are pretty insane and they can actually complement each other very well. If there are enemies outside, you can shoot your smoke grenade or smoke gun at them, forcing them to either run out of the smoke or staying into cover. Then you would just throw your ultimate at the smoke. This doesn't mean you'll get a guaranteed kill or anything, but you might actually hit someone with the ultimate, you might kill someone, but they'll more than likely scatter from the smoke, allowing you and your allies to pick them off because they just ran out of the smoke. So a great teammate to have on your team would 150% be Bloodhound, and possibly even Caustic. Bloodhound because no one else, not even Bangalore, can see through the smoke, except for Bloodhound with his ultimate, making it very easy for him to go in and take out the enemies in the smoke. Now you also have to keep in mind, other enemies who are playing as Bloodhound that use their ultimate will also have the same effect. They will be able to see through the smoke, not necessarily see through the smoke, but see the enemies in the smoke. Caustic is another great choice because when Bangalore shoots her smokes at the enemies, Caustic can throw his toxins in the smokes as well, making it even harder for the enemies to see where they're going because they won't be able to see the toxin traps until they're within close range, which means while they're in the smoke and they get hit by the toxin, they'll be moving a lot slower while taking damage over time and then Caustic will also be able to see the enemies that are poisoned. They'll have a green highlight which would also allow him to basically see through the smoke. Mangalore is great for all team setups since her smoke can practically turn the tables. Now keep in mind, like I said, you and your team, for the exception of Bloodhound, cannot see through the smoke, so the opposing team will have the same advantage when you're both in the smoke. Which is why you should never really go into the smoke, use it as a diversion or a view block, just to block snipers or really any anyone using ranged attacks from hitting you out of range. The only time you'd ever really want to go into the smoke is if you feel confident enough to take out the enemy whether they're wounded and hiding or just to go use it to escape. So that's pretty much it for Bangalore. She is definitely one of the easiest legends to learn and use as well as being one of the most useful in a team, mainly because of her smoke. Also for those of you that are wondering why I'm using two ARs, it's because it's just my preferred weapon build mainly because they're fairly accurate for both close and mid-range as well as dealing a good amount of damage which I find very useful for Bangalore. Obviously a shotgun would also be really useful but me with a shotgun or a sniper is not a good combination. 
but anyways that's pretty much it with this video i hope this helped you guys at all and if it did go ahead and leave a like and hit that sub to see more guides and whatnot make sure you also leave a comment on any questions you have or any suggestions that you may have i'll try my best to answer them to the best of my abilities and you know if i can't maybe there will be someone else that is more knowledgeable than me obviously there will be someone more knowledgeable than me and they'll be able to help you guys out let's go ahead and create a helpful community you guys this is all day they want on the ps4 have a good day good night and peace